with six, reproductive rights, and specifically abortion, just might be the most divisive issue in our nation right now. All this week, our viewers have shared many different views and stories with us, and we know there are a lot of perspectives out there. Tonight, Fox 11's Haley Winslow is live with one woman's personal experience. Haley. Yes, we have brought all different perspectives from lawmakers and religious leaders, liberals and conservatives. This is Rebecca Hogan's story. Almost a decade ago, college freshman Rebecca Hagen was pregnant again. Certain she would be disowned by her parents, devout Christians, Hagen walked into Planned Parenthood. In a moment of panic, it was really my life versus my unborn child's life. And I chose abortion because I thought that was kind of the best quick fix. She took the first pill for a chemical abortion and planned to take the second the following day until she got to the parking lot. I no longer felt relief. Instead, I felt guilt, trauma, and I was sad and I was remorseful and I was deeply regretting the decision to have the abortion. Still in the parking spot, shaking, she searched for a solution. Hagen found abortion pill reversal, which puts naturally producing progesterone back into the body. She was one of the very first women to take it, and it worked. That's like Raya. Zach is funny, he's witty, he's intelligent, he's bright. And my life is everything that I thought it wouldn't be. Hagen finished college, met the man of her dreams, and now they have four kids. She's turned her and Zach's story into a mission to help others. That there are organizations and people and resources out there available to you and your child, um, people that want to walk this journey with you. There is free health care, free emotional care, free support uh, available to you, and that you do not have to choose between your aspirations and your goals in life and the life of your unborn child. You can absolutely have both. And every day she looks at little Zach, hours away from never existing. I'm just so grateful uh, that I never have to wonder who Zachariah would have been and that instead I get to watch his little life unfold right before my eyes. In light of Roe v. Wade, Hagen believes that abortion should not only be illegal, she says it should be unthinkable. And it, if it is in fact overturned, she says she's looking forward to working together to come up with more resources and solutions for everyone. Now, again, that is one of many perspectives. Reporting live in West LA, I'm Haley Winslow, Fox 11 News. And certainly a beautiful child there. Haley, thank you.